Behind every one of our nation's fallen heroes is a story. A family who mourns a life cut short, and there is a nationwide effort underway to tell those stories, specifically for those who died in World War II. A local student is a big part of that mission, and you can be too. So this is a picture of him in the Navy. Mm -hmm. This is a picture he must have been before he left with, in front of his house in Medina. These are the stories behind the stars. The family had a uh, nut shop uptown in Medina, right on the square. The thousands of stars on the World War II Memorial in Washington, D.C., marking the more than 400,000 Americans who left their homes, their families, and paid the ultimate price for our freedom. He was on the USS Bunker Hill, the car aircraft carrier. He was kamikaze. Max Eakin, an only child, killed just four months before the war ended. Robert Evans played baseball, enlisted right after high school. 22 years old, he was shot down over the North Sea. He was just a little younger than my mom. They were real close. There is a national effort underway to tell these stories. The organization Stories Behind the Stars is looking for volunteers to help write the tales of every single service member who died in World War II. I want to make sure that their sacrifices are forgotten. Hudson Louie has been leading the charge for all of Ohio's fallen. He's the state director. At just 20 years old, he is the youngest director in the country. But his age gives him a powerful perspective. Them being my age and sometimes younger because I'm 20. So, you know, you even have people who lied about their age when they're like 16 to get into the service. It is, yeah something that I, I, I think about all the time when I'm writing about these amazing folks. Their sacrifices are something that I can't even comprehend. And to help our younger generation make that same connection, the stories will also be available on an app. You can scan a name on a grave or memorial with your phone, and then... You can read their whole story, essentially, from like the beginning of their life, um, you know, what they did in high school, and uh, like their you know, their service. More than 27,000 stories have been written so far. And for the families of the fallen, it's hard to put into words what this means. It's pretty neat because before this, there was nothing that would have, you know, would have been out there. We're losing all these veterans every day. People don't understand what, what they fought for back in the day. But now their sacrifices. Purple Heart, uh, the World War II, and the Asiatic Pacific War will live on in the stories behind the stars. And years from now, their bravery, their heroism for our freedom will not be forgotten. So I want to make sure that maybe even 200 years from now that they're still remembered. And the goal is to have all of those stories written by September 2nd, 2025, the 80th anniversary of the war's end. If you're interested in being a volunteer writer, we have a link in this story on our website at cleveland19.com.